Her cries for justice growing, along with calls for authorities to release eyewitness video of Tuesday's shooting. 10 News anchor Riel Creighton starts our team coverage. She is live with that mother's call for justice. Riel. And this is the spot, guys, where everything changed for that family on Tuesday. This was an incredibly emotional press conference. As several members of Alfred Alongo's family, maybe a dozen of them were there, including his young daughter. But the only one who spoke today and the only one that we heard from, and for the very first time, was his mother. Through tears over and over again, Pamela Bengay talked about the intense pain of losing her son how she now sympathizes with all of the other mothers and fathers who've lost their children at the hands of police officer, but officers. But the one thing that she wanted to make clear is that her son, she says, was not mentally ill. She says he had lost one of his best friends recently and was having a mental breakdown when he was shot, which she says is not the same thing as having ongoing mental health issues. Anyone coming. Mental breakdown is not easy to control. It needed someone who could was trained just come to calm him down yes. and then take care of the situation. That's all the call was called for, not to come and just finish his life. It was Alongo's sister who called 911. The family is originally from Uganda. Alongo's mother says they came here to flee war, asking the question, where do they go now? Now, uh, meantime, it is unclear, though, if the family who has been calling for the release of that full video, if they have seen that video for themselves. But I know I asked the question, and as of yesterday, they had not. We're live in El Cajon tonight. Riel Creighton, 10 News. All right, thank you, Riel. And at that same news conference, National Action Network President Shane Harris blasted District Attorney Bonnie Dumanis for not releasing the entire video of the shooting. If you can put a photo out, we want you to release the tape. Where's your nerve and your guts at now? We need you to release the tape because the tape shows the whole picture and not just a part of the picture. Harris calling on people all across the country to protest their local district attorneys this weekend. He is declaring Saturday National Day of Action and Justice for Alfred Alongo.